Hey everyone, ever wondered what the coldest possible temperature in the universe is? Today, we're diving deep into the frosty concept of absolute zero and uncovering some seriously cool truths. So what exactly is absolute zero? It's the point where the thermodynamic temperature scale bottoms out. We define it as zero Kelvin, which is about minus 273.15 degrees Celsius or minus 459.67 Fahrenheit. At this temperature, a system's internal energy is at its theoretical rock bottom. It's the ultimate cold. But does that mean everything just stops moving? You might picture atoms freezing in place, completely still. In classical physics, maybe. But in the weird world of quantum mechanics, it's not that simple. Even at absolute zero, particles still have a tiny bit of energy, a minimum vibrational motion called zero-point energy. So, while you can't extract any more heat to do work, things are still jiggling around a little. Motion never truly ceases. This leads to a big question. If we know what it is, why can't we just cool something all the way down to absolute zero? The answer lies in the third law of thermodynamics. It basically says, you can get incredibly close, but you can never actually reach it. Each step you take to cool something down gets harder and harder, requiring more and more energy. It's like trying to reach a finish line that keeps moving just a little bit further away every time you almost get there. You can approach it, but you can never cross it. But the journey towards absolute zero is where things get truly mind-blowing. As matter gets super, super cold, it starts to behave in extraordinary ways. Strange quantum phenomena pop up, like superconductivity, where electricity flows with zero resistance, and superfluidity, where liquids flow without any friction. Scientists have even created a bizarre state of matter called a Bose-Einstein condensate by cooling atoms to just billionths of a Kelvin above absolute zero. If you found this deep dive into the cold as fascinating as I do, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and join me next time for another journey into the amazing world of science. Thanks for watching.